But anyway, so to give you the context of syntropy, uh, Bucky Fuller always believed that um, contra to scientific opinion that is current right now, um, which is the second law of thermodynamics, which means that the world is in a state of degeneration. And this is what science believes. <coughs> you go to any of the universities and study energy and mass and matter and so on, you're going to learn that the world is degenerating. And Bucky always said, no, actually, we have the opposite, we have syntropy. And syntropy, so the word itself means to a higher order for an eternally regenerative universe. So he argued that we have entropy on one side and syntropy on another. And I'm saying these things now because there's a lot of complexity behind this and we're going to get to the sort of like the models that live underneath this shortly, but you have entropy and syntropy. I'd much rather inhabit a world where there is regeneration going on as much as there is destruction. I don't know about you, but you know, I, I like that one better. Um, and so, uh, <coughs> and this sort of diagram exp explains it. This is like light and refraction. Entropy is, is a higher order of disintegration. That's what's happening with it. Whereas syntropic is, is coming into a, a focus. It's towards, <coughs> excuse me, a eternally regenerative universe. They're pairs. They're partners, like my palm. You know, you can't say that this is the right side of my palm and that's the wrong side of my palm. They're pairs. We need them to work together. And so, um, yeah, the term syntropic enterprise was like, this is what I want to see. And then it became very clear that my, all of my work for up at, you know, until now and ongoing is how do we make syntropic enterprise as ubiquitous on Earth, which means that there will be more of these to balance it than these. And almost every business that we've got out there right now is entropic. Almost every single one. The good people, I'm not, you know, this is not about good or bad people. There are bad people. Good people trying to do good things within a system that is designed to wear down and degenerate and extract and exploit and extinct. It's, it's a design feature. And so I, you know, my, my focus now is how do we get this side to at least be equal, if not greater, than that side because it's a little bit like we've got to get the balance right. And so that's, that's the game. So to do that, we have to really start to unpack how things work and challenge every assumption because most of the, the assumptions that underpin how we do things, they're assumptions for a good reason. We don't think about them. And so we have to start thinking about what the assumptions are uh, and challenge every single thing behind it.